Hello everyone, today we have got two different Golf GTIs Mark 5 and one is from Matchbox, the other one is from Hot Wheels and we are going to compare how they stand against each other. So let's start with the Golf GTI from Matchbox. As you can see the front is nicely detailed. You got the headlamps which are there, a red accent outside the grill. Volkswagen logo and the GTI badging up front and when we come to Hot Wheels you see everything is there grill is made up, logo is there, headlamp is there but nothing has been detailed everything is just painted in the same yellow color coming to side you can see the matchbox has got those nice wheels and you can see again details on the tires it got very uh, simple and plain side which is uh, pretty close to the original car you see the door handle the mirror and on the backs and you can see the tail lamps are well detailed you see the Volkswagen logo again GTI badging and a small spoiler on the Hot Wheels GTI you can see the wheels are more bigger compared to the actual car and are more in line with the Hot Wheels toys you can see the Momo badging on the side. Again, you can see the wing mirrors are there and show the door handles. Nothing is detailed. Tires are plain, no detailing on them. The interior is red coming on the back. Tail lamps are there but aren't detailed. Bigger spoiler compared to the Matchbox car. And again, if you look closely, you can see the wheel arches are much more pronounced. So it's more up to a, like a modified racing car rather than the standard car. Now let's see what else is different. The paint shade in the matchbox is in purple and it's plain compared to the Hot Wheels one. So it's more closely related to the actual car. On the top you can see there is a cutout for the sunroof. Again on the sides the other side you can see the fuel filler cap and the interior is done in grey and it's Quite close to the actual car rather than the modified one which we looked in the Hot Wheels. Going back to the Hot Wheels GTI, on the top you can see again there is Momo badging or Momo tampons. There is again a cutout for sunroof and it's actually in clear rather than the uh, panel you saw on the Matchbox car. If you go on the other side you can see the fuel filler cap. And same badgings and tampons like the other side and the interior is done in red again going with the theme of more of a modified car so yeah at the end this one is much more on the side of a body kit extended and pronounced wheel arches so this is more of a modified car and the matchbox is more close to the standard car. Now if you see them together you can see the differences which are very apparent. And it's preferences, people like different things. I prefer the matchbox car more because it's closely related to the actual car. But even the Hot Wheels car they give it, they're not that far, a bit of detailing and it should look nice. Tell me what you think.